Also making news, talk about courage. Jesse Contreras didn't hesitate today when a man standing next to him fell onto the CTA tracks. What happened next, he's sharing only with two investigator, Dorothy Tucker. The man Jesse Contreras is kneeling next to is a stranger to Contreras, yet this morning he saved this man's life. Uh, for me personally, it's a God moment. It happened at the Logan Square stop on the blue line. Contreras was on his way to work. We heard a really loud thud. It sounded like almost like a giant like mattress sound or like a, like a heavy backpack or something hitting the, hitting the tracks. I saw a man fall on the L platform. According to CTA workers here at the Logan Square stop, the man had his back to the tracks and simply fell over. He landed just two feet from the deadly electric third rail, and the train was just minutes away. So Contreras jumped on the tracks. The train could have been coming any minute, but you jumped onto the tracks anyway. I did. I did. He was unconscious too. His breathing was labored, and his his skin looked very pale. I was afraid for his life and. I just, you know, he looked like he needed help. He wasn't going to be able to help himself. Contreras managed to drag the man to the edge of the platform, and that's where his friend, Michaela Melcote, was waiting. I think there was only four minutes left till the train, so we had four minutes, less than four minutes to get this guy up, to get Jesse off the ground. Melcote and a couple of others first started pulling the man onto the platform. The train could just easily have came and killed them both. Then they quickly pulled Contreras out. It's insane how brave he was. It's my duty to just help whenever possible. And that was my moment to help, so I just I acted on it. And police say the suspect, suspect actually, that the man was under the influence. He, he was taken to Norwegian American Hospital and treated for minor head injuries.